Hello everyone. Welcome to topic of the day. In today's video we shall be discussing about India's semiconductor mission program. For India, attaining self-sufficiency in semiconductor manufacturing can mean collective growth in the South Asian region. So let us discuss a bit about semiconductor. It is a material product usually composed of silicon which conducts electricity more than an insulator but less than a pure conductor. Semiconductors are critical technological components for emerging technologies for example artificial intelligence internet of things 5g communications cloud computing and automation if we talk about the opportunities for india india's consumption of semiconductors is expected to cross dollar 80 billion by the year 2026 and is expected to reach dollar 110 billion by 2030 Also India has an exceptional semiconductor design talent pool accounting for up to 20% of the world's semiconductor design engineers. India is also closer to Africa, the Middle East and European markets and even has a huge domestic market. Further on the value chain for semiconductors would ensure a multiplier effect on the entire economy. So let us discuss a little bit about the challenges or issues related to this. First, there is a huge requirement for investment to set up a fabrication manufacturing unit for semiconductors. In fact, the chip fabrications are also very thirsty units that means requiring millions of liters of clean water and an extremely stable power supply. It also requires more technical skills. Further on, we don't have adequate logistics. and also there is absence of proper waste disposal there was chip shortage felt due to covid-19 that have hit automakers with a revenue loss of dollar 110 billion in the year 2021 in addition the russia ukraine conflict had implications for the raw material supplies for semiconductor value chain if we talk about indian initiatives in this regard first one we have is the semicon india program that is to provide attractive incentive support to companies consortia that are engaged in silicon semiconductor fabrications then we have india's semiconductor mission that is set up as an independent business division within digital india corporation having administrative and financial autonomy further on there is production linked incentive scheme with a recent approval of outlay of rupees 76000 crore spread over a period of 6 years for the development of semiconductors and display manufacturing ecosystems if we talk about the semiconductor fabrications and display fabrications it would provide financial support of up to 50% of the project cost for setting up semiconductor and display fabrication units so for semiconductor development in india and a positive scenario ahead first of all we have to focus on the semicon diplomacy that means india must seize the opportunity and become an attractive alternative destination for semiconductor manufacturing semicon diplomacy is pivotal to india's act east policy which aims to build resilient ties in the asia pacific region also the government must develop policies that addresses all the crucial characteristics in the long run now let us take up one practice question on this topic consider the following statements first Semiconductors are class of crystalline solids intermediate in the electrical conductivity between a conductor and an insulator. Second, India makes up to 2/3 of the world's semiconductor design engineers. Now which of the given above statements are correct? You can write your answers in the comment section below. So as you know the correct answer is A that is only the first statement is correct. The second statement is wrong. as india has semiconductor design talent pool that is up to 20% of the world's semiconductor design engineers and it is not the 2/3 of the world's semiconductor design engineers as given in the statement therefore the correct answer is option a well with this we call it a wrap of today's edition of topic of the day i hope you like the video i will see you with some other topic tomorrow till then take care and do stay tuned